Well, Ben and Jen, the unions are asking that ocean management negotiate a fair rent agreement with them. But they say not only are they facing rent hikes, but their requests to fix poor living conditions have gone unanswered. Tenants united! We'll never be divided! Stopping outrageous rent increases and gaining respect is what a group from two tenant unions in New Haven are demanding from ocean management. They tell us nothing ever. We find out they're painting our doors when a painter just shows up and opens the door and starts to paint. The property management group owns more than a thousand units across the city. Tenants at the Elizabeth Apartments on Blake Street have been left without a rental agreement for more than a year. They were recently notified their rents would be increasing 20 to 30 percent, and that's not sitting well with residents. If we get this increase, like I, I'm going to be paycheck to paycheck, money's going to be tight, I'm going to be, you know, crossing things off my grocery list. While tenants at another apartment complex on Chapel Street are demanding the company provide adequate maintenance after their requests have gone unanswered, some say for weeks. Our radiators screech in the winter months and knock very unbearably. Um, and then I, when I asked Ocean to come out to fix it, we scheduled an appointment to do so. And then I took off work to do so and they just didn't show up. Renters also say safety concerns reported to the company haven't been addressed either. There's, there's a faulty electrical wiring in the basement that was elucidated to me by a Southern Connecticut gas employee the first day that I came there. Ocean, no. Following the rally, the unions posted a letter to Ocean Management's door requesting the company meet with them to come to an agreement. So ultimately our goal is to have an influence that's big enough that we can't be ignored. <laughs> Now, the unions have filed complaints with the city's Fair Rent Commission. That can intervene by reducing the amount of rent uh, tenants pay to even issuing fines to bring the company to compliance. Now, we reached out to Ocean Management, and we have still yet to hear back. Live in New Haven, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.